was originally why I don't know what I'm trying to say. Hey guys, Mel here. I hope you're doing well. Um, so with this video, it is my yarn dyeing video. However, I accidentally, in trying to save, add more space to my iPad, might have deleted some of the essential footage, including the original intro and some other footage that I had. So the video is not going to be nearly as good as I had hoped, um, because there's a bunch missing now, um, but I will still upload what I can. And um, so basically, I was dyeing yarn with some egg tablet dye that you use to dye Easter eggs. And um, so I tried two different yarns. The thicker yarn that I tried, which I show first, is a wool blend of 20% wool and 80% acrylic. And then the second one that I tried, which is thinner, um, is uh, mercerized cotton. And so basically I was trying to see how either would work. And with the mercerized cotton one, I did have to change things and use some food coloring because I did mess up on the colors of the egg tablets and accidentally paired wrong colors together, um, which created nasty colors. Um, so basically, yeah, uh, here's the footage and I will try to get another video up sort of soon and yeah. So anyway, I hope you're having a better day than I am. <laughs> so basically pour our vinegar and our water into the dish and then kind of mix it all around. Tablespoon of vinegar into each little cup. And then just kind of swish them around a little bit as I'm kind of spilling the pink, but that's fine. All right, and now the magic awaits as we pour a dye into the yarn. Not really sure how much I'm supposed to be using because this does not look like it's gonna, you know, do the whole thing. <laughs> like I almost feel like maybe I should have done this a bit more, um, but we are going to see how this works. Just kind of squish this in here. And then we will take a bigger thing of plastic wrap and then we will microwave it. Yes, I'm having some problems with the plastic wrap right now. So for this one, I'm trying blue and green. It's like a teal type of blue and a yellowish green. Or a pea green, I guess. <laughs> It does turn out, yeah, that the um, dye didn't really take much to the cotton. There is a little bit of like the red dye that took, so I'm going to try some more red food coloring um, with the with a little bit more vinegar and see if that does anything, and we'll see. So here is the wool yarn or the wool blend yarn that I had dyed. Um, yes, it did come out lighter than I was hoping, but that's okay. I think it's still really pretty. It's got like green and a little bit of blue and pink. Um, and then there are some areas that 
didn't get as much dye on it, but I think it really looks pretty. It did not up, <laughs> um, so I do have a few like small tiny balls, um, but these ones actually work for me because they're more like doll sized, so I can, you know, use these with like taking photos and stuff of my dolls if they're knitting or crocheting or something with it. And then the cotton yarn, um, it did come out this really pretty light pink, however, um, it never really like ran clear with the water. So if I was to rinse this again, it probably would lighten up even more. Um, so for this one, I bought some Rit dye and I will probably um, use that on this yarn because um, the Rit dye can be used on natural fibers. So I will dye that with this, I mean dye this with that. And so that's basically um, how this yarn dyeing came out. Um, not my best attempt at dyeing yarn, but not my worst attempt either. Um, my worst attempt was actually when I was trying to dye yarn with like um, raspberries or blackberries or something and I accidentally forgot to uh, take the seeds out. Um, so that yarn got really nasty because the seeds accidentally got caught in it. Um, then I learned my lesson on that. Um, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like. Please, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel so that you can see more videos that I post. And, you know, comment. Um, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!